Hello, Gemini. Someone at a distance is thinking of you. They want to communicate. There's a third party energy here, Gemini. This person could be trying to be your third party? Okay. Someone that you've already broken up with or not speaking to, they want a space in your life. Like, do you still have space for me? Do you still have room for me? Is there a vacancy at your home? Mm, in your heart. Show me Gemini in the energy today. Hope you are well. What's going on with Gemini? It was a matter of importance. Four leaf clover. Great good fortune. You could be dealing with an Aries. Okay. You feel something is lacking in your life. Love, money, or goals. Wow. Why? Someone is behaving stupidly. Who is in Gemini's reading? Recognition and reward and depression. Okay. Someone feels as though they've ruined their reputation. Is that true? That they've lost their status with you or in general? Time to get out of a situation. Yeah, someone feels like they're not where they're supposed to be. They're not being seen. They're not being considered. Family. This could be a family member. Or there's a crossroads about family involved. There's a choice being made. Mystery. S social media. Finances. Healing. Okay. Some work situation is coming into this. Maybe you feel here, yeah, someone feels it's lacking. Either money, goals, or love, but we do have finances. Money problems, work, material things, and success, yeah. You could be looking at someone online. You're checking out their background. Maybe you're looking to see if someone's working or if they're successful here, or they're doing this toward you. <laughs> Okay, that's, that's a little nosy. Someone getting kind of like nosy over here. There's healing. You're wondering if someone's doing better in life or have you fixed that? Have you changed that? Okay, are things improving in your world? You know, because someone in this reading has good fortune and they're concerned about someone who may not. This could be family. You could be looking up your family. Like, are you guys good or is someone good over there? Yeah, okay. Let's see. You're wondering if they're brave enough to make some changes in their life, in their world, and... But this person doesn't feel that way, by the way. So you understand that this person... Maybe they're posting things online too, Gemini. They could be posting things saying... You know, uh, I don't know what people post online that could sometimes be oversharing. Maybe something like that. Let's see who this is. Libra 12th house and Mercury. Yeah, you're not speaking to whoever this is. So who is this in Gemini's reading today? Seven of Wands. Very defensive energies. King of Pentacles. Especially about money and resources. They feel a lot of people are up against them. That is for sure. It could be the family. Wow, this person feels cast upon or set upon by a family. Like everybody's just after them or nobody believes them, you know. Nobody values me. Um, nobody cares. Everybody isolates me. Everybody's against me and my wishes, my dreams, and my hopes. That's what they're saying. They, they're saying that they may have made some choices in life that their family doesn't agree with. It could be for work or for career that they chose something that nobody cared for. Or, you know, you could have been doing something else that would give you this recognition and you chose that path. And now you're upset with everybody, but it's your choice. So it feels like someone could be blaming their family that their energy here where's gemini in this yeah so you're going to be communicating with this person they're very highly defensive six of wands oh gosh gemini eight of swords okay the thing is 
you want to share good fortune or you want to share good news. You maybe want to talk to them in like a chipper mood or a good mood, but you find out that they're not in that mood. They're actually very defensive. They don't want to hear any good news. They don't want to hear that you're doing well or you're happy or there's good things going on. That's not going to open up a conversation. It's actually going to shut it down. There's something that they have done or said that they're kind of covering up or they're hiding or they don't want to talk about. You may even have a solution for them, but it's not something they want to hear. They're not open for that right now. So you have 12th house, Mars, and Gemini. You could be angry that they're, maybe they've done or said something that you disagree with. And they could be upset with you and you're upset that they're upset with you at all because you feel like it has nothing to do with you. That's a side note. How does this person, yeah, how does this person see Gemini? Yeah, I feel like you're trying to fix something. Ten of Pentacles. So you have the family A-OK. -okay. You've got the backing. You've got the resources. You have support from people. People back you up. You're Everybody likes you. Everybody wants to be involved with you. You have that great and good fortune, and they don't. That's what they're saying. Why do they see Gemini like this? Because of the Eight of Cups. So they're tired of that, or you are. Okay, Knight of Cups. They're saying that you're not being very helpful, that you're spoiled or you have everything given to you or handed to you. Um, okay. This could be Leo, Scorpio, Pisces energy or Virgo. How does Gemini see this person? Ace of Cups, you care about them clearly. Eight of Pentacles. So you feel like this person's doing a good job or they need to continue doing a good job. It's like, just keep it up, keep going, you're doing good. Maybe you're hyping this person up. You feel like this person's very intelligent, but they're misunderstood or they don't understand their own intellect. You feel that this person, if they keep at it and they do something that they love, that it'll turn out for them somehow. Maybe it won't be a lot of money or it won't be a ton of resources or a ton of success, but at least they're doing something that they can contribute to, that they could be part of that they won't feel that everybody's against them for so that they could contribute to society or something like this why does gemini see them like this because of the page of swords this person wow oh wow they perceive everything as a slight right now so you know that they're kind of touchy or they're being very sensitive so you could be trying to help them. And I feel like we said this in so many words. You, you could be trying to assist them or help them or you have these ideas and stuff, but they're taking it as you're being hateful or you're being spiteful and they're biting back at you or they're arguing with you or something along those lines, okay? Yeah. Everything that you're saying they're taking it like an argument or like you're competing or like you're trying to push them down. That's anything that you say at all. So someone's not in the space to be receptive. We talked about this. All right. So you see that this person going through something. All right. Yeah. I feel like you're talking to them online or on the internet or you're thinking about them or something. You're wondering if they're good. You could be trying to look at them online. Even you are being perceived as an enemy you may not feel like you are. What is this person? Wow, this person just feels like you have nothing to worry about. And I feel like they kind of hate you for that. And hate, okay? They dislike you or they don't like the situation. They don't like that energy. Someone doesn't like that you don't struggle or someone, I don't know. Okay, it's like, well, of course you would say that or you would do that because you have it so easy. You never know what it's like to struggle or something. It's like somebody feels like you don't have anything to fight for because you're just good. 
All right. What does this person want with Gemini? Oh my gosh. This person wants you to know and see that they are successful on their own. That's what they want to be seen as. They want to be perceived as independent, self-sufficient, able to manage, that they're happy, that they're loved, that this is what they want from you. Like, I'm successful. Look at me. I got it. Like, I did it. You said I wouldn't or someone said I wouldn't and I did anyway. But they want you to see them at a distance. <laughs> so, all right. What does Gemini want with this person? Okay. Ace of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles, and the King of Pentacles. Okay. Well, Five of Swords. Power. There could be um, a married couple here, be it you or someone in the environment, a married couple. Maybe you're wanting this person to see that anything is possible or successful. I feel like you have good news to share as well. What is this here? The devil. The five of swords. Oh. Gemini, what? There's something that you need to confront here. There's like an abuse of power. Um, yeah, hatred, spite, or something. Somebody could feel that they are set upon or cast upon because they look different or they're a different type of person and nobody likes them because of this or they don't fit in and that's the reason why their life is falling apart. I feel like someone is vouching for their limitations here and you have to bring something to light about that or you're trying to. Like you're trying to make someone realize it's like actually no, you're that's not why it's because you're young or you're inexperienced or it's because I don't know, <laughs> there's other candidates or there's other options. I don't know. <laughs> Someone's trying to say, okay, where's Gemini right here? The death card. Yeah. See, because you're trying to end some hostility but it's almost like someone may not want to hear that. I feel like you could be trying to bring some abuse of power or manipulation to the forefront or the idea of it, and you have the solution to fix that or to talk about it, put it out in the open so everybody can see it, you know. Um, like finally end a family feud or finally put to rest this, you know, hatred. You're trying to squash something. Yeah, so everybody could work together again. You can start fresh, start new. That's what I see that you're wanting to do. But they think that everybody hates them, whoever this is, or that you do or something. They could even be gossiping about that, and you're gonna wonder why. It's. I feel like you're asking them, did you say this, did you say that? It's not true because of this, or I could prove to you why this isn't true, or there's a reason for that. Like, I feel like you have reasons for things, or you could explain something, and they may not wanna hear it, okay? Yeah, so second house, south node, and Leo. All right, so what does this, what's gonna happen between um, nine of cups? What's gonna happen between Gemini and this person? Two of Wands, Justice, wow. 
Two of Cups. Okay. All right. Looks good. Emperor. So you've got Aries, um, Cancer, and Libra energy. Where's Gemini in this? Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, you could be... Something very artsy is coming in for you, Gemini. Wait a minute. What's this? Yeah. I feel like you're trying to um, settle something with a person. You're trying to call a truce or end this war. This family war, family feud type energy. Where's this person in this? Ten of Wands, the Ten of Cups. No, because it, this is someone who feels like it's too much to be involved with everybody, this home life or these people, this family. Uh, they could be wanting some space is what I'm seeing. Okay. This feels cut and dry right here. Yeah. It's like, well, you feel bad and you should. Like, someone's saying that. It's like, you feel bad, well, you have to, or you should feel bad. You know, that's what happens when you act or behave in certain ways. Or that's what happens when you believe certain things. That's what this is. All right. So the Page of Swords, the Judgment. Yeah, I feel like there's going to be an extension here. Um, it may take a while for someone to come around. I do feel eventually they will come around or there'll be some conversations. It just feels like um, someone's trying to start over elsewhere. Okay, what is the supportive or beneficial energy for Gemini regarding this? Personal issue reaches resolution. Yeah, I feel like you're trying to heal this. So you will. Now, the thing is, I feel like on their part, they may draw it out or drag it out because they're not fully ready. But I do see some movement. Yeah, your commitment is being tested. Okay. Mm -hmm. What can Gemini focus on? The answers you need are coming. Yeah, if you have to confront someone, you're going to get the answers. Because I feel like you're, you're genuinely trying to heal some like old i don't know old problems old conflicts old issues something real old or pervasive something that keeps happening it's already been going on and you're trying to move past that okay so you're going to get the answers that you need you and your loved ones are safe yeah let me get one for this person you got full moon in gemini and full moon in cancer maybe this is about your family we did talk about that could be dealing with the cancer something is going to heal i just feel like someone could be taking some time your hard work is paying off new moon and cancer the energy is gaining momentum yeah this person's starting over they're starting fresh they're starting something new and there's a choice for them to make they got to choose wisely uh what's the beneficial energy for this vulture basket energy Time to take action. Yeah, get moving. So I feel like they're going to be. They know that they need to start moving. They're taking action here. Time, take time to breathe out. Hmm. So action and rest. Something's going to take time to grow. Okay. If they're angry, I see them. Um, it could be hurt, but it's coming off as anger. I see them letting off some steam or they need to. Thank you so much, Gemini. Check your other placements for more different information. Get a well-rounded view, full picture of what's going on there. And I'll see you next time.